Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a brand new video. Obviously, this isn't an old video, huh? So today, I wanted to sit down and film some new drugstore makeup. I'm pretty sure this is new. I recently started getting PR packages from LA Colors. Shout, shout out to you, LA Colors, for hooking it up all the time. I was lucky enough to receive their new cream to powder makeup which are these right here i literally received every single color so i wanted to do a review slash swatches on these new products because honey la colors has some really good products and nobody talks about it it's like we need to hype them up okay so we're going to sit down and talk about the products i'm actually sitting down and filming this intro at 9 30 at night because i was editing my video and i realized that i didn't film an intro so that's what I'm doing. I'm going to stop with the chit chat. I hope you guys enjoy this review. Let me know what other videos you guys want to see next. And let's jump right in. I have so many foundations here and I hope that one of them matches me. I'm going to show you guys the card that they sent among with amazing stuff. So this is the LA Colors Skin Perfecting Primer, which is this one right here. It claims to blur fine lines and pores, and it is an, an invisible primer. Now, the rest of them are a cream to powder makeup. It's a creamy, blendable coverage, velvety finish, and it shows you here the amounts or how many uh, foundation, foundation range. Can I speak? They did organize them from clear to the darkest shade which is the shade cappuccino this is what the primer looks like again it says preps skin and fills pores skin perfecting primer and it's just a clear shade it has this really cool like hollow sticker i'm going to use the brush that was sent to me which is again this one and we are just going to press this all over the skin i really hope this doesn't make me oily because some primers can make me look super oily there we have the primer now i'm gonna look at myself up close to see if i see a difference okay my pores actually look a little bit smaller and i have humongous 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 pores so this one i'm gonna keep an eye on i am going to see if if it's me if not if it fits me. I'm going to see if it makes me oily or not. Now, let's start with the swatches. I literally have every single foundation shade right here, which I am very thankful for. Let me figure out how to swatch it for you guys. I'm going to open them first really quick. Okay, I am back from swatching all the foundations and I have to say that I am super, super disappointed because I could not find a foundation out of all the ones that I have here that was a match for my skin, which I'm sorry, like I don't want to wear something that's not going to look good on my skin because I want to give you guys the best reviews of the best. So what I'm going to do is I am going to use the LA Colors foundation. We're just going to apply that to the skin. 
And then we are going to use one of these as a cream contouring and see if maybe we can get it to work that way. But yeah, let's go ahead and proceed. I'm actually going to go in with the shade Caramel, which is this one right here. This is the one that looked the most warm and not too cool tone and not too dark. And I'm going to use that LA or the LA Colors brush again. It's going to go in and start bronzing up the skin. That looks really pretty. It's almost like a very soft finish and it is going to set into a powder finish which I can really appreciate because I don't want to always go in with a powder and set my contour, you know? So we'll see how this works out. I am loving how my skin looks. Now let's apply a little bit of highlight. So I ended up doing a little bit of nose contouring with the cream colors and then I did a little bit of white on the center. These are the two colors that I use. And even though I didn't find a shade to match my skin tone, like the actual color of my skin, guys, I love this for cream contouring. If you are into cream contour and you don't always want to set your cream contour with a powder, Pick these up. First of all, they're super inexpensive. They're very creamy. They're very velvety and they just look beautiful on the skin. I literally did not apply bronzer on top of this. Like, this is all cream powder. I am so bummed out that I couldn't find a shade to match me, but that's okay because I know that I can work with these and still get some sort of use out of them. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video regardless if it was a little bit of a fail. We made it work. We stayed positive and we went through and finished the video. So I hope you guys again enjoy this video. If you do want to pick these up, I think you can find them at your local family dollar. I'm not sure. I will have the LA Colors website listed down below. It will also list all the products that I use in today's video. And also, if you guys want to see a makeup tutorial on the eye that I'm looking, what? On the eye that I'm wearing right now. I look that I'm wearing right now. If you guys do want to see a tutorial on this, then let me know. Leave me some purple emojis in the comment section down below, and I will be sure to film it for you guys. So yeah, that is it for me. Thank you for watching. I love you guys, and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day or night, wherever you are. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.